Hello, welcome back. I'm teacher Mariana and I will be your teacher today. Today, we are going to talk about occupations. Let's remember that occupation is a job or a profession. But first, we are going to remember verb to be. Remember, we have subject pronouns. I, you, we, they, he, she, and it. We use verb to be to talk about a quality, a job, occupation, or even a nationality about a person. And we have three different structures for verb to be, negative and positive, and question four. First, we have I, we use am in positive, and I'm not in negative. Then we have in plural, you, we, and they. We use are in positive, are not in negative, and aren't it's a contraction or the short form or of are not. And then we have he, she, and it, the third person. We have is in positive, is not in negative, and isn't is the short form or the contraction of is not, whatever you want to use. And here we have the positive or negative structure. The structure is first the subject pronoun, plus the verb to be, plus the verb. Okay, here we have I am in positive, I'm not in negative, a nurse. You are in positive or are not in negative, a firefighter. We are in positive, are not in negative, happy. Here we are talking about an emotion. They are in positive, are not in negative, a doctor. And then we have the third person. He is in positive, is not in negative, a vet. She is in positive, is not in negative, a teacher. And it, remember, we use it for animals, places, or things. Is in positive, is not in negative, a police officer. Okay, we know that an animal can be a police officer, but it's just an example. And then we have the question form. Is a verb to be, plus the subject pronoun, plus the verb, plus the question mark. Am I a student? Am I a student? Are you Sad? Are you sad? Are we waiters? Are we waiters? Are they bored? Are they bored? And then we have the third person. Is he a chef? Is he a chef? Is she dancer? Is she dancer? Is it a dog? Is it a dog? Okay, let's remember. We have verb to be. For I, we use am and I'm not. For you, we and they, we use are and are not or aren't in the contraction. He, she and it is in positive, is not in negative or isn't in the short form. Okay, and we have three structures. And to describe people, we use the verb to be to talk about the clothes or anything that they do. For example, here we have a nurse. A nurse wears a white hat, a white blouse, a white jeans, a white shoes. Or, for example, a teacher, she is wearing a white blouse, a blue t-shirt, and a blue skirt. And we also have a waiter. He's wearing a black jeans, a black blazer, a white blouse, and a red bow tie. And for example, we also have a police officer. He is wearing blue hat, blue blouse, blue jeans, and black shoes. And there is some examples for describe people. You can also describe the feelings, the hair, the skin, 
their emotions and everything that you want to describe. Remember that a description is when you are telling something about another person. Thank you for watching and leave your comments below. See you later. Bye.